Back to our coverage of the coronavirus outbreak this afternoon, the governor announced more ventilators have been delivered to Connecticut. The state has also received more than 200,000 N95 masks, and we've also learned Connecticut is getting a special device that will allow those masks to be sanitized and reused. Eyewitness News reporter Matthew Campbell is standing by with the very latest, including the governor's plan to eventually reopen the state. Matthew. Yes, Aaron, Governor Lamont spoke with the governors of Delaware, Pennsylvania, New Jersey, New York, and Rhode Island, all discussing what it's going to take to reopen and possibly when and how this is going to look like. Now, this is what we know right now. You know, this is still very much a work in progress. And for Connecticut, it's going to be very tricky because when we look at our numbers, it's the metro areas that are seeing the most cases. Counties like Fairfield, New Haven, Hartford, they're seeing the most. Counties like Litchfield, Wyndham, Holland, the more rural ones, really are not seeing that many. So Connecticut looks a lot different from New York, where so many cases are concentrated right there in the city. So when it comes to reopening, we're likely going to take a different path. And we wanted to know what this is going to look like and what type of criteria could be used. This is what we were told. Yeah, that's why I've got this advisory group made up of business leaders and scientific leaders. Um, I do tend to think we're a relatively small state, so maybe you say, hey, open up Tallinn, keep Fairfield County uh, closed for a while longer, look at the infection rates, and also look where the trends are going. And, uh, you know, if everything's opened up in one county, closed in another, you may, in, you know, incent people to travel back and forth across the state to buy things or go to a restaurant. And none of that is any good for what we're trying to accomplish. So you heard some of the risks there that Governor Lamont was talking about, and he says when the states reopen, do not expect this to all look the same from Delaware all the way up here to Connecticut. Things will be taken uh, differently, and each state is going to do it on their own. That is the latest live here above the newsroom. Matthew Campbell, Channel 13 News.